hello everyone welcome back to another video how are we doing thank you for coming back to watch my video so today i'm going to be talking about kafi kafi is a nigerian dancer kafi won or she broke the guinness uh, book of record in the year 2006 yes that year 2006 i know i watched that episode she danced for 55 hours and 40 minutes so she broke the guinness book of record kafi is a dancer everybody knows kafi so in january this year kafi came up and said she's um leaving her marriage she's quitting she's divorcing her husband that was in january of this year so everybody was like wow 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 and wow not be today dance so you understand when people they dance they dance for social media, but for their hope, like fights, like they day, you know. Social media will not help. Social media, everybody comes out. Everybody live fake life, you understand? <laughs> Most of all the celebrities, they are so, so fake life. People come out, you go to see everything, they okay with them. Whereas, they are battling a lot, you know. Social media is a level, levelier. Oh God, I don't use bad English. Anyway, more now, forget that one. So... Let's go there. So, what did happen today? Why am I doing this video? Kafi can't come out today, can't say. For three years in her marriage, before the divorce, before that January that she announced her divorce, that she was celibate. What did they celebrate for? Woman did they celebrate for her marriage? Hey. Not even when I'm going. Well, not to know the apple of this world, though. Like, everything, like, there's nothing one will not hear. Do you get? There's nothing one will not hear. Kathy came out and said, and said she was celebrate for three years. That means she wasn't doing the do. She wasn't sleeping with her ogre. She wasn't doing anything in the other room. You know that thing, that thing, that thing. She wasn't doing nothing for three years. She said that gave her time to heal. Hey, Father Lord, Father Lord, Father Lord, have mercy on your people. <laughs> so now, so she can't talk. Oh. She's older than the husband, but that is not why the marriage uh, actually, um, uh, uh, that's not why the marriage did not work, right? Kathy revealed in January, she didn't really talk about, you know, what happened. Yeah, you know, she don't really talk like that. But this one we yet few hours ago. She can't talk with the apple, babe. Can't talk, say she don't want to do the marriage, so she can't talk the marriage. Why she don't want why she know why she says she not go do the marriage so now she can't young. Now she can't tell the world. She can't tell us with the social media in laws. Say that so that so say that this one be the reason. Why she not really want to do the marriage again? Keep watching, guys. The view, she don't talk about domestic violence. But she say, oh, God, Joseph, and me, her ex-husband. Ide la law. Ide la law. You know, <laughs> that is, eh? Ide la law, her friends. The guy, they enter her friends, because, you know, he said, even her best friend, the guy entered the, the guy entered the baby. He said the guy they shit on her with strangers and her friends. Like the guy, it is core. It is core, like it is core. As long as that person I, you know, you wear skirts. You no, know, anyway, we may not be able to wear skirts again. Everybody they wear trousers. You understand? The guy will just score. He said the guy they shit on her like pure water. When he might use pure water to describe her, or like aggregate bread. You say pure water now everywhere for Nigeria. Everybody who no know pure water for Nigeria. Who no know aggregate bread <laughs> for Lagos. So he said the guy they shit on her like that. Even her best friend, he said the guy entered the bakus. The guy entered the sacred forest of her best friend. So now I make her. And now she can't talk the reason. 
you know, before when she came out in January and talked about that her marriage was coll had collapsed, that, you know, that she can't go ahead with the marriage, like, you know, she, she's going on here to divorce her husband. She didn't really tell us what happened. She wasn't, um, maybe she wanted to keep that side to herself, you know. She just wanted to keep that. She didn't want to bring that to the public. But last, last, she can't do one interview with uh, Judy. Judy, Judy, oh. Now she can't do the interview. Now she can't talk the reality where Apple say her husband this shit. So I don't say men this shit, women this shit, right? But you want can't go shit now. You know if you can't go do one for far, you can't do one with her friends. You can't they sleep with her friends. They sleep with strangers. Say even disease, the man give her tired. Yeah. So that was why she stayed for like three years. Three years after that, that marriage lasted for nine years. They got married in 2012. And the divorce happened 2022, January of this year. So that should be about eight or nine years, right? If, I'm, if my arithmetic correct. So for that nine years or the eight years, three years for inside, they were not doing anything. So marriage, when a uh, conjugal thing, not they, when husband and wife, not they do the do. When husband and wife, not they, you know, they enter each other. That will not be marriage now. So maybe she was just thinking, maybe the guy go change, maybe they, he just they give her and they try, you know. She said that was a, that was when healing started. <sighs> you know, say this uh, infidelity for marriage eh, is something that is, it breaks the, the, whoever is, in, whoever is involved. If not the woman is cheat, it breaks the man. But the marriage shit, it breaks the woman because I've been married for 16 years now. I don't marry for some, almost 17 years of marriage now. I don't do now. So it's very painful. Say you can't see, say your partner went over and don't they? Because husband and wife, that's what they build. This husband and wife build. Like there's this bond between a man and a woman. If you don't trust anybody for this life, you could trust your spouse. If you don't trust anybody, at least you could trust your spouse. So if your husband or your wife called the shit on you, you can't know. Not even he pay no, they pay no. So she could not take it anymore and she had to like let go. So what did they happen? What did they worry people when they shit? In the first place, how were you even going into go into marriage? I believe uh, people should be matured enough to go into marriage. And when I when I best like me, when me they marry, when me want marry, I did not marry for love. Oh. Maybe that will be topic for another day. In short, I will talk about myself. If my subscribers count, don't reach 1,000. When they subscribe to my channel, I go, in short, many, many things there when I go reveal to, like, you know, you know, to also teach people, to also, you know, motivate people. You understand? <laughs> many things were, but now I'm not going to want to talk because I need my subscribers count to make it, make it, make I reach out to people, make, you know, if my subscribers count, don't reach 1,000. I can't talk about many things. When me marry, me not marry for love. I got married because I was already matured. I made up my mind. And I didn't marry for money. I didn't marry my husband because, oh, I see I'm for Marshall. No. So there's more even to love. Love sometimes is not enough. Yes. Love is not enough. Both parties have to be responsible. Not be say you go to say you love him, I go to shit on you. You go to cry. You go say but I love him. It doesn't make sense. That is why I say love is not enough. Me, I don't marry because of love. I marry because I was ready. I was ready. Yes. Hurt me anyway. I got married because I was ready. Is it good to marry for love? I'm not. I'm not saying it's a bad thing, but. You should be ready. You should be mentally ready. You should be mentally ready. That is very important. Not be say you marry. You marry, never reach any interesting. You don't think you could sleep with your, your wife friends. And another thing, cafe yourself, you yourself, you never get friends in the first place. You not get friends. So if your friend, your husband, they toast your friends, they call it the open leg. You not get friends. Those ones are no friends. Yes. I will say that categorically. Categorically, yeah, with my full chest, coffee, not get friends. If your friends can open their legs, 
or your husband to enter you know get friend those friends they not be your friends so guys now so the tori reached to deal if you love my content guys kindly subscribe to my channel <laughs> encourage your girl <laughs> encourage this baby girl this mama encourage her you understand this youtube street eh? the also is real it's not easy yo. hey hey i'm gonna encourage you to subscribe to my channel thank you guys for watching till next time i love you have a great weekend and bye